She's the rebel with a cause. To the colonising Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth. Who didn't tell her party boss she was dating an ex-rebel. The ABC has revealed Victorian Green Senator Lydia Thorpe was in a relationship with former bikey boss Dean Martin. Brotherhood's awesome. A past president of the Rebels Victorian chapter. At the same time, she was on a parliamentary law enforcement committee receiving confidential briefings about bikey gangs and organised crime. At a minimum, Senator Thorpe needed to disclose to me her connection to Mr Martin and her failure to do so showed a significant lack of judgement. Adam banned forcing Lydia Thorpe's resignation from her Senate leadership role. She has told me that at no stage was there any breach of the rules regarding those committees or her work, but that's not enough. I accept that I've made mistakes and have not exercised good judgment, Lydia Thorpe said in a statement. I will now reflect on this and focus on my important portfolio work, especially advocating for First Nations people. I note that uh, Senator Thorpe has said uh, that this is a, an error of judgment. Uh, that's the least description that I would put to it. I've never seen anything like this in my 20 years in Parliament. It's clear that Senator Thorpe is not fit to be in the Australian Parliament. Now, this is a test of leadership for Adam Bant. Three eminent integrity experts telling the ABC they were troubled by Senator Thorpe's lack of disclosure. And with respect, I agree with them. In matters of integrity, perception is often just as important as the actual facts. The Greens leader also critical of his own chief of staff for failing to tell him about the relationship despite a concerned Thorpe staffer raising it with his office a year ago. I should have been told about this and I have made that clear to my chief of staff and I have counselled him. Adam Bant is still awaiting a finance department report into complaints about Lydia Thorpe's office culture and her alleged verbal abuse of Indigenous elders in a meeting last year. The senator may have been stripped of her leadership role, but Mr Bant has indicated he's prepared to go further if the party room sees fit. Andrew Proben, ABC News, Canberra.